Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Wayward Cine here. Nice to see you all. Thanks for coming back and joining me for episode two of my YouTube series where we go through my back catalogue of games and play them and then I review them. And we're up to episode two, which is great. Uh, so today we're going to be looking at a real-time strategy game called Act of Aggression. So let's get stuck in. Let's see how trad RTS this is. Active Aggression, a real-time strategy game developed by Ugen Systems and published by Focus Home Interactive, promises to be a return to the golden era of RTS. But sometimes promises are real hard to keep. Defcon 2 available. Defcon 2. What can we do? Originally released in 2015 and with a rebooted streamlined version released almost a year later, Active Aggression on the surface has the feel of a classic strategy game. Like some mutant love child of Command and Conquer Generals and Company of Heroes. Sadly, this progeny doesn't quite live up to either of its parents. Unit is under attack. Graphically, it still looks good. The gameplay is reasonably slick, sound design is also great, but something just doesn't click when you're playing. Maybe it's that while there is three factions, they mostly feel the same. There's a few new systems they trial, such as Prisoners of War, which can be used to generate income, but overall it doesn't feel distinct enough from other strategy games, and the upgrade system in-game is muddy and not as intuitive as others from this genre. I had a crack at all three of the factions, and while I didn't have a terrible time overall, I would say it's a game I won't be rushing to play again. There's better RTSs out there which do essentially everything this game does, but better. If you're looking for an RTS hit, why not go back to those classics like Red Alert, Company of Heroes, or StarCraft? You'll have a much better time of it. In the end, it's not a terrible game, but save your money. I surrender. Defeat. Defeat most foul. Episode 2, In the Bag. Yes! Okay. <laughs> well, thank you for watching the video and for making it this far. If you liked this video, please hit the like button. That would be really great and would help me so much. If you would like to subscribe, you can just hit the subscribe button and you will be notified whenever I release new videos, which I'm hoping to do weekly. Um, so if you want to hit the, that would be great as well. Uh, and of course, uh, you can head along to twitch.tv slash wayward underscore cine. Uh, I will be streaming uh, different games every Wednesday at 8 p.m. Australian Western Standard Time. But besides that, take care of yourselves and I'll catch you next time. Bye.